Today I've partnered up with Little Ondine to share with you the Magic Night Halloween gift set and show you how to create five super easy Halloween designs using only a toothpick. In case you're not familiar with Little Ondine, they are a non-toxic nail polish company that makes water-based nail polish so you can just easily peel off the manicure. The set I'm using today comes with five mini-sized bottles and an adorable spooky box. This set is available on the Little Ondine website for $30, but I have a 20% off or a $5 off coupon that you can use and I'll have that linked in the description box below. Before all of the swatches, I applied one coat of the Little Ondine Secret Base Plus Top Coat to ensure that they'll peel off easier. Sealing the colors in with the top coat will help them last longer as well. First up in the collection is Curse Purple, and this is a bright magenta purple shade. This was opaque in two coats with a gorgeous glossy finish. Next is Pumpkin Orange, which is exactly that. This was a little sheer, but it built up nicely. I did do three easy coats. These polishes dry pretty fast because they're water-based, but the texture is different than regular polish. It's gonna feel a little squishier. Moving along, we have Magic Black, which is one of the most opaque black polishes I've ever used. This applied perfectly in one coat. The Magic Night Kit also features a beautiful gold glitter called Pirate Gold that has large gold hex glitters and a clear base with smaller holographic glitters. This can be worn alone, but to get it fully opaque, I'd recommend sponging it on, or you can wear it semi-sheer, which I love to do with chunky glitters. You do need to manipulate the brush a little to get the glitters in the right spot, but it's pretty easy to do. And as you can see, this glitter also looks amazing over the black, orange, and purple polishes from the set. Last in the set is a very shiny silver shade called Goblin Silver. This applied smoothly and opaque in two coats. You might need three coats depending on your nail length. So the great thing about Little Ondine is that when you're ready to change up your manicure, you don't need to get the acetone out. You just peel off the polish. And as you can see, it didn't peel or damage my natural nails at all. And like I mentioned earlier, if you seal in the color with a secret base and top coat, your mani can last four days at least if you can resist the urge to peel it off. So now I'm gonna show you five super easy Halloween designs using this set and just a toothpick. For the first design, I'll be applying Goblin Silver as my base color. Next, I dipped my toothpick into the Magic Black shade and I created a cross on the tip of my nail. Then beside that, I added a rounded tombstone. Connect the two gravestones with a solid black line and then if you want to, you can add a little flying creature in the spooky sky. Next, we'll be doing a funny-faced little jack-o'-lantern, and for this, I started with the pumpkin orange for my base color. Using the toothpick dipped in magic black again, I started with his zigzag mouth. You don't need to try it super hard with this. I think an imperfect mouth gives the design a cute, kooky look, but if you do mess up, you can always go back with the orange polish and fix any mistakes. Then, I added two triangles for the eyes. Next, we'll be creating a friendly little ghost design, and for this, I started with a generous coat of pirate's gold. Then, I added a layer of the secret top coat to smooth out the surface before adding the ghost. To create the ghost, I used the brush to make a large circle blob for the body, and then I dragged the blob down into a teardrop shape and added two arms. Finish with some facial details and that's it. To create the next design, I began with the Curse Purple for my background. Then I dipped my toothpick into Goblin Silver and I made diagonal rays coming from one corner of my nail. Connect the rays with curved lines to finish your easy spider web.
And lastly, we'll be doing a haunting crescent moon on a glittery night sky. For this design, I started with magic black and then applied pirate gold over top. To create the moon, I first sketched the basic crescent shape, and then to sharpen it, I went back with black around the edges. Finish all of your designs with a generous layer of the secret base and top coat, and that's it! There you have five super easy Halloween designs perfect for beginners. As always, I'll have everything I used in this video linked below, and don't forget to check out littleondine.com for more non-toxic, peelable polishes. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time!